The moments that stick out for me the most, um, my time on The Late Late Show, are all of the opportunities that I've had to almost be killed by oncoming traffic. There's nothing as invigorating as a performer than performing in front of traffic lights uh, with people who haven't been informed that you're performing something. It really is actual normal people in their cars getting very annoyed. There's only a few that are really excited and actually even recognize you. The rest just think you're weird people dressed in costumes in the middle of the street singing. When I was up on the hood of the car and the snow was coming down, and it was like 100 degree weather at the same time, it was like between that and singing at the Super Bowl, I can't even, I can't decide which one was better. It definitely keeps the adrenaline going, and it also is always fun to imagine this is your last performance in life. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here. I can tell you now, the next musical we will be performing on the crosswalk is... Oh, 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 oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! What does this mean? It doesn't matter, it's frozen! It's frozen! The whole thing's ruined! We're doing frozen, right? Since we performed the iconic Les Miserables in Paris, people keep coming up to me saying, James, when are you going to take this further? When will we see the company doing Madame Butterfly, La Traviata, Cosi Van Tutti? I look them in the eye and I say, screw that, we're doing Frozen. <laughs> we will not be undertaking this expedition to the frozen tundra of the soul alone. Joining our cast on the crosswalk, the stars of the motion picture Frozen. <laughs> This is actually my third time joining James in the crosswalk, but you know what they say. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times, shame on you. Again, that's how it works. Playing the role of Olaf, give a big hand to Mr. Josh Gad. Who else could it be? Who else could it be? Playing the role of Christoph, the one, the only, Jonathan Groff! Oh, yeah. Playing the role of Anna, the incredible, Kristen Bell! Yeah. Yeah. And the role of Elsa, the frozen queen with a voice that echoes throughout the heavens, will be played by, I mean, come on, who else? But James Corden, what? Oh my God, yes, 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 I can't believe that. Woo, okay, ah. Oh. I'm aware she played Elsa in the movie, and I'm sure she was fine. But this is a live performance, something Adina Menzel knows very little about. Last but not least, the coveted role of Sven, the, the grumpy reindeer, will be inhabited by the wickedly talented Adina Menzel! Yeah! Yes! This is going to be great fun, guys! Yay! <laughs> I'm sure James is going to be really great. I mean... Before I sing Elsa's songs, I have to warm up for at least an hour, and I drink tea, and I have to get my sleep, and I got the humidifier in my room, and that's on top of the years of training I've done leading up to this, but, you know, James just bought a blonde wig, so it's basically the same. You're cold, you're freezing cold. You're cold, but then you realize the cold never bothered you anyway. <gasps> so it doesn't matter, exactly. I can't believe it. This is a dream come true. Ever since I was a little girl, I have been running into crosswalks and breaking into song. It's actually been quite a serious problem, and there were a, a few close calls. Now, when you're out there, it's live traffic, real cars, okay? But you've got to keep going. If you get hit, you know what you do? Let it go! Let it go! Let it go. Keep singing! Keep singing! enjoying myself, but I have to say that James is one of the most annoying people I've ever met. Oh, look who it is. Pissed off Christoph. <laughs> <laughs> Cheer up, mate. Uh, Might never happen.
So Frozen is set in the beautiful backdrop of the Scandinavian mountains, and that's hard to beat, but that gas station is a close second. to build a snowman. Come on, let's go and play. I never see you anymore. Come out the door. It's like we're going away. We used to be best buddies, but now we're not. I wish you would tell me why. Do you want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. Go away, Anna. OK, bye. and I will shut up if I'm the only one who feels this way, but um, I, I really kind of think that Adina should play Elsa. Oh, what? you're so sweet. It's fine, totally, it's totally good. Don't you guys agree? Does anyone feel this? I think that, Anyone, yeah. anyone? Okay, fine, fine, I'll tell you how we'll finish this. We will decide in a sing-off. An epic okay, sing-off, OK? I'm Whoever's got the best yes, voice... Lovely. Yes, yes, yes. Lovely. ...is Elsa on the crosswalk, OK? Ladies first. Into the end. Into the end. You know, sometimes you have to make sacrifices for the greater good. Sometimes you have to let it go. James, who dresses a uh, snowflake. That's right. That's cool. I don't think I remember that character. Oh, it's a character. It is? Yes, it is, Jonathan. It's the titular character. The movie's called Frozen. I am Frozen, therefore I'm more important than you, OK? So get over it. Who was that? Who did that? Who did that? For years, I've roamed these empty halls. Why well, have a ball? With no balls, finally they're opening up the gates. They'll be actual real life people. It'll be totally strange. But wow, am I so ready for this change? This for the first time A snowflake. I'm calling him Simon. Oh, you know, James, 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 James. Yeah. I'm so sorry, this is mm. kind of awkward, but the next song we're doing from Frozen 2 actually takes place in autumn, so we don't need a snowflake in this next number. Oh, I get it. I'm being punished. That's what this is. I'm being punished. Oh. I'm being punished because of my talent, aren't I? No. So there's no snowflakes? No snowflakes? We'll see. Yes, the wind blows a little bit colder, and we're all getting older. That's why I rely on certain certainty. Yes, some things never change, like the feel of your hair. They came alive when I came on. Did you see that? Yeah. Came alive. Came alive. Okay, guys, this is it. This 
is the showstopper. Idina is going to go out there and she is going to sing her heart out, although not as much as I would have, but that's fine. Like I said, I got over it ages ago. I'm playing a bigger part now. Here we go, guys! Yeah! Let's let it go! Never bothered me anyway. <laughs> <laughs> 